Hey guys, Blizzard here. How y'all doing today? So today in this video, I go to an aquarium shop in Dallas. Um, it's like the North Aquarium Dallas or something like that. Something like that. I don't remember the name. I get things mixed up. But I got a special fish from there that I've been wanting for a long time. Um, I'm not going to say what it is, but you'll see it definitely in the video. Um, actually, see it a couple times, I'm pretty sure, in the video. But um, anyway, this is pretty exciting for me. I've been wanting this fish for a long time. And I'll give you all updates and everything on Instagram, Twitter, and all that other stuff like I always do. Um, all my other fish are growing really well though, um, and I'll give an update on them all, all of them in another video, maybe tomorrow or something like that. But anyway guys, um, yeah, anyway guys, hope you guys enjoy this video, and uh, peace. That is so cool, all these different aquariums, and oh wow, look at all this, this is insane. This is my favorite. Oh, this is like the Amazon yep. thing that you're talking about. Yep. So what fish are you trying to get? I'm trying to remember the uh, one here. Spotted. Yeah. Is there is there one in here? I don't know. Oh, look at that golden bristle nose right there. It's mm -hmm. pretty cool. And that that one kind of looks like a big one. Yeah, it does. Definitely not enough. Mm -mm. I don't know where the otters would be. It was a fun one. Well, oh wow. They would be in one of the fish rooms. Yeah. Oh, look at this. This is like an African cichlid aquarium. You have blood parrots, and then you have, um, let's see, there's a pleco. That's what you were thinking of. Mm -hmm. uh, and they get much bigger than that. Um, electric yellows. That's really cool. A peacock. It's really beautiful. Venestis, I'm pretty sure that's what that one is. I'm not good with fresh water. Oh, yes. This is, that's pretty. This is another... They have sea fans. That's a sea fan of some kind. I don't know what color because I can't see because of the blue. Um, and then you have a devil's hand right there. Oh my! Wow! Look at those urchins. That's a that's a spine urchin, uh, like a striped spine urchin. That's really cool. These are different types of damsels. And see, like you could place if any of those touch, it's just like they they die instantly. It sucks. What are you looking for? There's a lot less of this now than when we were here. Oh, wow. Yeah. I don't know, Aston's thinking for her snake. I don't know. Don't look there yet. Okay. I won't look in there. Hey, no. So, let's see. So this is... Oh, look at these uh, cardinals. These are the... Cardinals are the easiest saltwater fish to breed. They breed very easily in the home aquarium. Um, uh, but they do grab group, best in groups of like four or five. Mm -hmm. um, and then you have a striped spine urchin right there. Um, and then you have some clownfish. I don't know what type of clownfish that is. I don't know. I'm not really good at clownfish names. Um, anemones, of course, and sea fans. Very, very pretty. What? That? Oh, that's a uh, dragonette. Uh, they're, 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 they need specific water parameters in order to live. So you have to make it perfect for them. And it's, it, I can't do mine because I don't have a sump, which is like another type of filtration. They have a sump. So see... Um, by your urchin, do you not touch venomous? Right? Uh, um, that's not that, I don't think. No, because I think that's the uh, perfect kind of urchin. Or yeah, um, I'm not really sure where that is. Um, it could be hiding in, underneath one of the rocks. Oh, I think that's it. Maybe. Where? Oh yeah, that probably is it, I think. Maybe. I don't know. Um, but see how they have like an overflow? That overflow goes into a sump beneath here mm -hmm. and then it goes like through different filtration and then it comes back out of these. It's really, really uh, that's what you pretty much need for like a, any big aquarium other than a hundred gallon. Because they don't have, um... Yeah, they, this is just like a, a, a plain base aquarium. There's no like sand or gravel. You don't need substrate in a saltwater aquarium, but a lot of people do it just because for the look. Yeah. Oh wow, look at this fish in here. <laughs> um, yeah, you can like buy these little little nano aquariums. It's really cool. I think my first ever saltwater aquarium was in one of these. And uh, uh, had like a gigantic anemone and like two conifers in it. And it was beautiful. And then I upgraded to like a 55 gallon, which was really cool. <laughs> what is this? This is a 300 gallon. This is definitely what I'm looking for, a 300 gallon aquarium. Hey Vanya, yeah. does our thing take Samsung Pay? For sure. Okay, yeah. This is... Alright, thanks. Wow, this is definitely right. for sure what I want. This is a 300 gallon. 
This is the. You can either buy them like deep, like this, or lengthwise. I would buy this deep because deeper is better. Um, and this is another. This is 310 gallons. So this is where. And see, like it's a lot cheaper here. Like this is so much cheaper than it would be um, in a, on online. Mm -hmm. I mean, this is insane. This is a 310. That's a 300. And that would put, this is probably the max I would go, like that for right now. And see, like, oh my gosh, wow. Look how big that thing is, it's so cool. And then this is, oh wow, this is pretty. That's 150, but as you can see, it's like deeper, right? Mm -hmm. Instead of like lengthwise, um, which is interesting. A lot of these aquariums are gonna be deep because it's harder to keep longer ones. Oh, there's a sump. See, that's an example of a sump. Um, see how they have... I don't know your terminology. Oh, that's okay. What? Oh yeah, look at that. So, these are like baby corals. This is what they start as, as frags. And frags are like those little things on the bottom. That's really cool. And look how pretty like some of this is. Those are adorable. Now, I don't know any of this. Um, I don't know any, many of these corals at all. At all, actually. Oh, whoa, look at that. Look at that baby yellow thing right there. Just oh, these are seahorses, aren't they? No, no. What is that? Seahorse. I don't know what that is. That's Wait. definitely not a seahorse. Yeah, no, for sure. Oh, that's a that's a molly. Oh, is that yeah, a crab? Yeah, some molly. Look at the crab. Oh my gosh, look at that. That's a that's an emerald crab. That's an emerald crab of some kind. I can't even notice it. Um, but that's a yeah. You can put mollies in salt water. Really? Mm-hmm. They can live in salt water. Only different types though, like black molly and the silver molly can live in salt water. So it's really interesting. They, this should be for seahorses, but I don't see any. What? They actually have. Yeah. Because they have sea fans, they have everything that a seahorse loves. So I don't know. Like the, the chains to grab onto? Yeah, the things to grab onto and hold on. What is that? I don't know what that is. Let's see. Oh, that's, is that, I guess that's his plant. I don't know. That's, that's a big plant. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is the overflow. See how that like overflows onto the, uh -huh. it's really interesting. And then, see look, here's an example of a sump. Yeah. There's a protein skimmer in there. Um, and that goes, see they go into there. That's a carbon sponge. And then it goes down into there, then pumps out of here. Look at this light though. That's a small light that lights up this whole thing. It's yeah. incredible. Oh, that's bright. <laughs> yeah, very, very bright. Oh wow, look at that. Look at that green chromis right there. That one in the back looks like uh, broccoli. Uh, broccoli, yeah. Um, those are really, really cool. I don't write that one in the middle. Mm -hmm. cool. Is Everything's... that a regular blue light or a black light? This is a, a um, light. yeah, this is a black light. Um, it's like, you know how you use for glowing fish? Uh -huh. mm -hmm. This is exactly what they use. Cool. Now, you don't need this on all the time. You could do like a regular light, and they need to be on regular light for 10 hours. Oh, you disappeared out of nowhere? Huh? Oh, yeah, those are pajama cardinals. Looks like these weren't spotted pants. Yeah, exactly. That's why they call them pajama <laughs> pants. Because they look like pajama pants. Whoa, look at that purple tang right there. See that one with the yellow tail right there? Yeah. That's a purple tang. And look, there's a... $300. Yep. Yep, I know. That's cheap. That's cheap? That's cheap. Yeah. Um, and then there's a cult, yellow eyed cool tang right there. The one with the yellow eyes, of course. In the back? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And then... Wow, you have so much. Look at all this variety. Don't drop your phone. No, I know. My phone's waterproof anyway, so it's okay. Oh, look at the snail. Ooh. They have all yes, these. I love these. I, I want a bunch of these. These are really cool, too. Oh, look at all these betas and jars. And... <laughs> look, 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 look at the tree. Look. Oh, yeah. They're so tiny. Yeah, see, that, that, that's what I want a tiny tank on the mm -hmm. shelf for. Mana tank. $100. Yeah. No, they're nocturnal, so they're really cool. Um, and then, look at that guy down there. yeah, that guy's a clown trigger. That guy's a clown trigger. They get over to a foot long. I want one. Yeah, no, they're very aggressive. Oh my gosh! Looks like a seal. You're so cool, dude. I love him. Not literally though, but yeah. 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 Look at you! Ah! <laughs> look at that Spanish hogfish, dude. That is so cool. What else is here? Oh my gosh, there's a Nazca tang! Oh my gosh, look, there's a blue tang! And a fox face! Oh my gosh, there's two blue, three blue tangs! 
That guy doesn't look like he's doing well though. Oh, never mind. There we go. Oh my gosh, look at him! I, I hate how they separate. Oh my gosh, look at that! Look at the Nasco Tang! Oh my gosh! These, are, these might be. That's just Silver Scat. I know that one. But I don't know what these are. What are those? I have no idea what those are. Guys, you'll have to tell me in the comment section. I have no idea what those are. What are these? I have no idea. I can't read them. Silver Seat, Hermit Crabs, XLG, Extra Large Damsel, that's that one. Gobies? Gobies? No, there's definitely not a Gobi. I don't know what that is. Oh my god. I know. Sadly not. Look at that fish. That's the that fish. It's a dangerous clip of fish. Dangerous clip of fish. Oh no. It's very rare. Oh my gosh, look at the fox face, dude. Oh my gosh. Oh, wait, look at this. What? Oh, he just, he just. Oh, that one? Yeah, that's like a type of goby of some kind. And then look, look, this is a flame hawkfish. Long nosed hawkfish, dude. Look at that thing. Like interesting thing about these, they don't have swim bladders at all. They're, they don't have any swim bladders, so they just have to sit on rocks. Interesting. <laughs> oh my gosh, look at this, guys. Look at all these freshwater aquariums. Holy crap. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is a jaguar cichlid. Holy crap! That thing's huge! Look at the plecos. Look, there's a jaguar. Or um, a tiger shovel nose. That's what that is. I don't know what I said before. It doesn't before. look like it's here anymore, but last time we were here, they had a quite, that was like this long one of these tanks. Really? Yeah, it's probably, it probably just a temporary housing. Yeah. <laughs> wow, look at that axolotl right there. Uh, axolotl worms, insects, monkeys. Look at him. This is Jerry. There he is. He's just chilling. Just put him in, actually. So there he is. Yay! Look at him! He's eating! Oh, my sweet boy! He's eating. Oh, oh gosh, poor guy. The jets are really strong, so I'll probably have to turn them down. Oh my gosh. Look at him! He's so hungry! Yay! I'm gonna feed him a shrimp later on today. So I'll record that too.